Today we will refurbish this uh, Casio CTK 541. I bought this uh, a while ago, it's like been five maybe or six years ago, with the two other keyboards, but it was stored in the garage all this time. It's not in a bad shape, so it's just clean. Uh, it's clean. I just need to remove the stickers. There's a red paint here. And if you can see, I don't know what that is. The, the plastic looks like textured or something. And also it's uh, sticky everywhere, like an uh, oil, oily touch to it, it has an oily touch to it and uh, yeah, I will take it apart, see what's inside and uh, wash it, then review it maybe in another video. So I hope you enjoy this video. So this is what's inside, it's very clean, let's have a closer look. We have Sanyo speaker drivers for all 3 watts and this is the main logic board. We have Oki. Casio and Ipsen. That's the other uh, speaker driver, and this is the amplification board. This is the chip here. So let's just clean it. It's pretty clean inside, so I don't know if I should take it apart further. Maybe I just need to clean it from outside without disassembling it totally. 
Okay, let's start. Okay, now we cleaned it. Let's have a better look. So we have a hundred songs built in songs bank, including some Chinese ones, and we have hundred tones and hundred rhythms. And uh, on the back, we have MIDI input and output, sustain for sustain pedal, which I don't have it, and phones output, and DC 9 volt, which is center negative. This is the model and the info that you might be interested to read what do we have here anyways let's test it now and see what the sounds are okay now let's turn it on and give it a quick test 9 volt center negative power on this is piano piano 2 hunky door whatever Thank you. 
is some of the rhythms songs let's choose uh, Katyusha
yeah, upload a video with all the songs, but I'm not sure right yet. If I do upload it, you will find it at the end of this video. Thank you for watching.